Happy Friday. Yes, it is Friday, and that means it's an FNA Friday. And to go back about what I said yesterday, I lied. What lie, may you ask? Well, last week I said this was going to be the end of my How to Take Your Animation to the Next Level series, but then I went through my email and I have a whole list of things I want to show, and then I forgot that I had this one specific piece, and I could put it into my conflict FNA, which is coming, but I thought let's do one separate one because I want to show the whole thing and not just one little small clip as a reference for conflict. So today it's going to be the last one, I promise, of my series. So this is part five of how to take your animation to the next level. So why did I lie? What clip is worth a lie? I apologize for lying, but this clip is so good. This is a kid that is trying to push a garbage can or a compost can, it looks like a garbage can, it's black, towards a certain direction. There's a lot of winds coming there. So why am I showing you this? Well, in short, it's a weight assignment. There's a lot of pushing, there's a lot of pulling, but the best thing is that there is conflict. So to me, I'm not a massive fan of things where you just move your character or move an object, whatever, because then it just becomes movement. It's not, it's animation, but it's not really character driven where a character has to make choices based on conflict, based on things that happen to the character where they have to find a solution for a problem or an obstacle, whatever it is. And in this clip, there are so many problems. I mean, it's one reoccurring problem, but it's so good how the kid perseveres. So when I look at this, this is to me about a kid that really, really tries to do what he's supposed to do, which is the chore of taking out the garbage. And it's not a piece about weight. And the way the kid has to handle this and the way the problems keep on piling on is just such a good example, at least to me subjectively, of how you can take a weight assignment and again, take it to the next level. But let's play the whole thing and I'll narrate through the things that I like because it's so awesome, so let's start. So it's clear that he has to push this over and then what happens? Bam! <laughs> there is wind. Poor guy takes it in the face. There are different ways of how he tries to push it forward. It pushes him back. It's kind of like a Sisyphus type of up the hill thing. He thinks he got it, but no. There is one more thing that happens. Oh, and it pushes him back. He struggles and struggles and struggles. And again, you think, okay, now this time he got it. And there's more, more <laughs> problems. And he's trying. Now you got from a pull, you got a, from a push, I mean, to a pull. Now he's trying and trying. So there's conflict, <laughs> there's contrast and more problems. He's pulling up his pants, but he's really trying. And that's why I love this piece. Let's go through this in detail. So you have him pushing this thing and it's pretty easy, but you have nice line of action, nice form, but it shows with that triangle. This is the force against it. He has the force this way and he's trying and trying. You think, well, that's an okay assignment. It's not too heavy. And then as he stops paying attention and takes the hand off of this that keeps it down, I'm assuming here, you have bam. And it's not just a hit that stops here. It's a hit that really pushes him down. And you go from a C curve, the way he was doing it before, let's go back, right? You got this line of action, it's going this way. And now as it pushes back, bam, and it's really, really pushing him over. It's so exaggerated, but he doesn't give up, but you have, you have a little bit of struggle here as he goes back, pushes it back here, and then that little adjustment there, that's great. And then you go, well, let's do this again. And the fun thing to me is that it's not, well, I'm gonna push this, and go maybe till here, and then it happens again. It's no, it cuts him off right away. Nope, you're not doing this to me. Bam, back in his face. And he did not expect that. He has to go back. It's almost back to the start. So there's a lot of contrast in posing and in movement. I'm curious why he keeps looking. Maybe someone's telling him keep going, or maybe he doesn't want to get caught for failing, quote unquote. So then he goes and we think, okay, well, that's okay. Now we finally settled and you might potentially only go this far animation wise so that the shot is not too long. But then it happens again, again, he takes his hand off, bam! It's a pretty hard hit, holy moly, bam! In his face. Then he struggles, get a little bit of contrast here where there's some rotation in the movement. There's probably more happening here. That's why we have a little bit of a blend here. But then this one, and that's your big change where, well, now it's not just the top, now it falls over and it's really, 
being pushed by the wind here and he's trying so now you have from a push where he is going here pushing to a pull it goes this way and he wants to pull it back there so complete contrast of body mechanics and he tries there's more rolling over this way that he tries poor guy he's so determined oh and this one just as you think it's done you got another massive hit in his face poor guy look at this he trips over <laughs> this is so mean i shouldn't be laughing but look at this really complex mechanics nice silhouette thank you for making it so awesome you got this little piece that kind of wiggles watch that as it goes back let's watch the the lid here blip, 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 blip. again that's some fun detail animation that you could do he pulls up his pants uh puts down his shirt actually it's not his pants puts down his shirt and then that's it and I mean, you could continue where he might make it till the end, or this could be the end where maybe he pulls the shirt down and goes, ah, and then walks away. And it's this kind of angry walk, bum, 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 as the container lid flaps. That could be your end animation for, again, something more complex where you're done with the body mechanics of weight and pushing and pulling to a walk. It's kind of like a 180, maybe he walks towards us, or maybe he walks towards the camera. Maybe he knows there's a security camera. And he has this angry face and you can go from body mechanics to facial acting and maybe turns off the camera or something or he waves towards the camera because he knows someone's watching him maybe he goes from angry to maybe it wasn't that bad and he laughs so then you get an emotional a gear change in there and so on and so on you can pile on the different exercises on top of this as i said you can always kind of escalate to something else but I wanted to show you this because he cracks me off that poor kid and it's mean but when someone gets slapped in the face I know this is mean but it cracks me up so if you can do something where it's not really malicious and really hurtful but something that can still be somewhat comedic what I like is that he is determined and he continues and that's also why it goes from a away piece to a character piece you show how he pushes through the struggle he finds different ways to find a solution because that's his chore, that's his objective. I need to do this. And regardless of what happens, I'm gonna continue. And I also like that with the shirt pulled down, it's almost like, no, it's almost like this with sleeves. Like, no, it doesn't matter what happens to me, I'm gonna get through this. So all in all, I thought a really, really fun piece. And again, something where you can take something entertaining and elevate an exercise into something entertaining. And you can show off so many different body mechanics and animation skills, and it ends up being a character shot and not just an assignment but that's it i promise this is the last one i am done this was part five and the last in the series of how to take your animation to the next level as always if you watch the whole thing till the very end i highly appreciate it like this if you like this and if you want to get all the notifications of all my uploads subscribe and hit the bell button for all the goodies thanks again for watching and i will see you next week Bye.